If you are watching this video, it's because you enroll in one of our life sciences courses. And the first thing you may be asking yourself is, do I really need to learn statistics? The short answer is yes. A more elaborate answer would be absolutely yes. This week, I'll try to convince you that statistics is not only useful, but is an important component of your life sciences degree. How do we know that the smoking causes cancer? Or that the Earth travels around the Sun? Or that elephants are bigger than mice? Well, the study of where the knowledge comes from is called epistemology. In epistemology, there are several schools of thought. One of the most important across centuries is that of rationalism. For rationalists, knowledge is based on reason. That is, reality has a logical structure. And the senses deceive us. So you have to think hard in order to understand nature. Rationalism has many problems. One of them is called the problem of authority. And because I'm not an expert on that, let's hear what Bertrand Russell has to say about it. To modern educated people, it seems obvious that matters of fact are to be ascertained by observation, not by consulting ancient authorities. But this is an entirely modern conception, which hardly existed before the 17th century. Aristotle maintained that women have fewer teeth than men, although he was twice married, it never occurred to him to verify this statement by examining his wife's mouths. That's it. If you're a pure rationalist, you will end up believing things for which you don't have any support at all. There is a different school of thought called empiricism. For empiricist, knowledge is based on experience. So experiments are central to knowledge, and the ideas are influenced by experiences. In other words, seeing is believing. Importantly for you, science is empirical, and that's why we need tools to measure and analyze our experiences. So at this point we have to define what is statistics. The statistics can be defined in many ways. In Whitlock and Schlatter, they define statistics is a technology that describes and measures aspects of nature from samples. In one of my favorite textbooks, Biometry, by Sokol and Wolf, statistics is the scientific study of data describing natural variation. Or just in the Wikipedia you can find statistics is a study of the collection, analysis, interpretation, presentation and organization of data. Okay, they look similar, but they're a bit different. The very same Sokol and Rolf they say in their textbook, the number of definitions you can find is limited only by the number of books you wish to consult. But actually, many books on statistics omit a formal definition. You can check that. Here, I'm going to give you another definition of statistics, which I think is simpler, but it makes much more sense. Statistics is the science of uncertainty. Simply, because we can never be 100% sure of any outcome in nature, we need to quantify the uncertainty of our observations. And that's why statistics is used.